Welcome to Career Journeys, a series of videos by the Consortium for Public Education. Here we explore the career experiences and pathways of professionals from a wide variety of careers to help you think about the skills you'll need and the paths you might take after high school. Gina Barrett, Director of Partnerships with the Consortium for Public Education. Today I'm here with Justine Russo, Director of Sustainability and Business Intelligence for Pitt, Ohio. Justine, thank you for being with us today. Thank you for having me. This is exciting. We're happy to have you here. Can you tell us a little bit more about what does the Director of Sustainability and Business Intelligence do at Pitt, Ohio? I guess I should start with saying Pet Ohio is a trucking company. Uh, we do freight transportation as well as solutions for our customers. So we have trucks, we have terminal buildings, we have 25 terminals right now. At Pet Ohio, sustainability is really the job of everyone. So it's being done throughout our operation, throughout our vehicle maintenance team. We think of sustainability as people, planet, and purpose. So it's really done as part of our driver team, as part of our human resources team, I get to actually coordinate and lead our sustainability steering committee. Um, so my job is really to take all of that information and to knit it together and really understand what's happening in the organization as a whole. Sounds like you have a, a touch with a lot of different di uh, careers within one organization. Yes, uh, that's true. And uh, my career has actually been with Pitt, Ohio for a while now. So I've actually had the privilege of working in several departments. And I think that's given me an advantage for being able to work with so many different groups. About what's a normal day like for you? I know you described what you do, but what does that look like in a day? Do you have a normal day? Or are they all different? So what's exciting is we have certain reports. So we have a carbon calculator. And so we're trying to understand our overall emissions. So there are some monthly reports that I do. Um, and so that's pretty regular. But a lot of what we do is based on what the data is showing us, then we come up with projects. So how are we pushing the business forward? What are things that we can be doing that are innovative? What are things that we can do to help our customers further. So that's where it gets exciting. Yeah, there's some regular work, but there's also um, fun projects. So it's always changing. That's what I look for in a job is how, how do you keep it exciting? How do you keep learning? Uh, that's something that was really important to me. And it's one of the reasons why I've been at Pitt, Ohio for so long. What is it about you that makes you good at your job? I, I love data. <laughs> So I've been really uh, lucky. I originally wanted um, to go into environmental studies um, and I got my degree in civil engineering, but when I was done with it, it didn't really have that business aspect. And I really loved understanding how businesses worked and how business strategy worked and really understanding um, how do you measure success. So I wound up taking a little bit of a side step and going into information technology um, and staying at Pitt, Ohio. But then uh, about 10 years ago, our owner said, we need to be the most sustainable trucking company. Uh, so we need to figure out we started with how, what is our carbon footprint? And so then all of a sudden it became a data problem. And because I was a data person, that's how I got back into it. So, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's, I think my skill set is I really love finding the data, looking at the data, and then trying to figure out what does it mean and um, what can we do to uh, change. So can you tell us a little bit about your, your post-secondary education when you graduated? What did you, what did you go on to? So I got that degree in civil engineering and I said, boy, I really like business. So luckily I had a mentor and I said, what do I do? I, I have this degree in engineering. How do I use it in the business world? And he said, well, why don't you think about getting an MBA? So that's exactly what I did was I took the MBA and I applied a lot of the engineering and process thinking to business processes. So it worked really well to understand um, how do systems work 
at Pitt, Ohio? How does the data flow? How can we optimize the information that we have to make better decisions? So it, it really all tied together for me in a way that I didn't expect it to, but I got really lucky. <laughs> Well, that's great. If we have someone who's watching this video today and they're wondering, I'm in school right now, what is something that I could be doing to maybe prepare myself for a career like Justine has? Because this sounds like it would be something that would be a good fit for me. What can someone be doing right now to, to help them further along? Uh, I would start with taking statistics really start understanding um, the, how, how the data sums up, what do the underlying statistics look like, really to start to understand um, how do I get at data, so maybe some database classes or querying. Um, there's lots of programs out there uh, like SQL or um, R is a statistical program. So think about things like that. And I would also say um, having a way of thinking about problem solving. How can you um, look at a problem and really start tying together? Where do I, how do I start unraveling it? I, I jokingly call it unraveling the spaghetti. Sometimes things look, things look really daunting, but when you really start to pull it apart into more simpler pieces, then all of a sudden it's not such a hard problem to solve. Justine, is there any other um, advice that you'd like to give students who may be watching today, whether it's for something for your career or maybe just Pitt, Ohio in general? Yeah, I just would like to say, you know, a lot of people wouldn't think of uh, sustainability when you think of a trucking company. Um, and I just would like to, you know, first of all, say how immensely proud I am of Pitt, Ohio. Uh, we have invested in solar and wind and microgrids at several of our uh, terminal locations. Um, we have invested in LEED certified buildings, really made them beautiful facilities to work in. We are investing in electric trucks trucks and are actively working to lower our carbon footprint. Um, it's a very carbon intensive industry to move all of these packages around. And we need bright and talented people who will come into the industry and help us figure out how do we reduce the carbon footprint uh, for the entire country. Justine, thank you for being with us today. We really appreciate you taking the time to do this. Thank you so much. Really appreciate the opportunity to talk about what I do and Pitt, Ohio. For more information or to learn about other careers in the Career Journey series, visit our website and check back soon for our next installment. Thanks.